how to create or make a layout in ArcMap. So previously you will be there are basically two display the arc the data view and then the layout view. The layout view is where you will produce your map and uh, export. So uh we're here to create a layout view. So the first thing you will do on the layout view is to go on the file and you go to page and print setup okay so um you select the paper size you're working on let's say you're working f you're doing a study area map and you want to put it on a3 okay you can just come down here then you depend on but this one i think lance uh, portrait is better but then you now set scale map element proportionally to change in paper size in pitch size okay so let's okay it like that so the whole thing has turned to an a4 paper size so what you need to do now is to arrange every other thing that you want and you arrange them the way you want and then already in the previous video we've done this so we we'll just make adjustment to them uh okay what scale should this be so let's adjust the scaling uh okay let's leave it at three million and then this one at let's make it a scale that is a scale okay let's leave it at this and then you can come to insert and then you bring your your text that's your headings so you just type anything so that you can make adjustment to it okay so come under here to make so let's say study under study area map so you can come to change symbols make it bold do anything you want change font change everything and then you okay study area map if there's anything you want to add you just add then if you want to bring in your your not arrow let's just pick any one but there are many not arrow so if you want to pick your not arrow you just bring it you can drop it here you can drop it here anyone depends you can even put it below the inside but then let's do it this way uh, i don't know whether it's proper to put another not arrow on this insert down here but let's just put it so you can also put in uh grid okay let's use let's use this let's just make it a tick and let's finished so we've put grid on the first one you can do the same here and then but then it is not advisable when you're doing something that has to do with boundary for you to use utm so when you're using but creating boundary you use w you use um uh what is the name self you use uh when you're creating a map that has to do with boundary you used so let's remove this 
you don't use this you use this one you don't use this uh utm measurement or whatever it is so labels only and then i'm just hurrying up to have it produced so you use this and then you do same here bring in your insert and you bring in your your what now your legend and there basically no much of a legend here so but then let's just bring something out so i have other videos that has to do with uh all of this editing uh editing but this is too much editing legend and all that so basically you can bring everything under you can bring in scale text scale bar and all manner of that but then when you're done and you're satisfied you hit the export button so to export on this uh let's say we're done with this map to export it you come under file and you come down to export map and then you wait So here you can export in EMF, EPS, AI, PDF, SVG, scalable vector graphics, PMB, JPEG, PNG, and TIF, GIF. So you can export in different formats. So I want to export it just as simply J JPEG. Then give it a name, give it a location, and you hit save. So that's all. So for more videos, visit our video archives.